black pink. It's pink, it's the revolution. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, guys, I am going to be doing a makeup look inspired by the new black pink video, Kill This Love. What made me want to do a look inspired by this video was, of course, Jenny. During the part where her and Lisa were kind of like side by side, uh, rapping and whatnot, she had this like very like interesting, like just this nice like, halo eye with like the shimmer going straight down from her top lid all the way to her bottom lid. And it just like, that was like one of the best parts of the video for me. So that is what I'll be recreating for you guys today. So in the makeup look that Jenny had uh, in this specific look, her brows were very, very, very natural. They weren't too filled in. And her skin, her skin was a very, very a natural matte finish. So we're gonna go with that today. This is the Ikon cosmetics confidence in a foundation but yeah I have to say guys the video was absolutely amazing um, the visuals were on point again my favorite part my favorite part was when uh, Lisa and Jenny were in that kind of I think it was like a room or something like that and they were just rapping and just kind of posing and things like that and Lisa's makeup look was very cool as well when she had like the pink on pink lip thing going on with the blonde wig that was that was really really nice as far as the actual song goes I didn't really care for the song itself I mean it was a nice song but it just didn't like uh, how should I say this it didn't like get me like hype or anything like that it didn't really uh, it didn't really get me excited black pink always comes with the visuals and that's usually what gets me is black pink's visuals their visuals are on point amazing if I had to pick my favorite part of the song and I'm kind of surprised because usually with their songs my favorite parts are whenever uh, Lisa does her parts or whenever Jenny does her parts but I actually liked uh, Rosé's parts a lot in this song and also I love Jisoo's parts in this song as well just because they kind of like they were subtle compared to the other parts of the song, but they just stood out a little bit more, especially with the visuals paired up. Jisoo's visuals for this whole video was like that part where like she had like a little sculpture thing around her. I don't even know what it was, but that was great. So I'm gonna go in with three or two different concealers, I should say, but three different ones. I'm going to be keeping the concealer a little bit natural today, just because they're her under eye wasn't like super, super bright or anything like that. So I zoomed you guys in up close so that we can do the eye portions. So the palette that I'll be using today is this guy right here. So this is the Makeup Revolution Fierce as Fire palette. But Jenny was wearing a lot of these similar shades, just kind of like having a nice like, almost like the halo eye looked very soft, but very intense at the same time. All right guys, so what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna take a flat eyeshadow brush and I'm going to take this shade right here and I'm going to place that shade on the inner and outer portion of my lid. All right, and what I'm doing now is I'm taking that same brush and I'm going right on the edge and just kind of angling that red shade upwards and blending it with the same flat brush into the upper part of my crease, just so it creates that angle so that my eye looks more lifted versus like drooping down. And what I'm gonna do next is I'm going to take this red shade right here on a blending brush and I'm just going to take that right over top of both of those red spots that I put there and literally I'm just going to take this and literally blend it back and forth. Now that what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the same flat eyeshadow brush and I'm going to go into this orange shade right up top and I'm going to place this down as our like base shade for our shadow or our halo eye I should say. I'm going back in with that blending brush and I'm literally just going to go into that orange and blend that orange into the outer portions. The way that she had it, you almost don't notice that it's a halo eye unless you look really, really closely. 
because it is blended really, really well and really, really seamlessly. All right, guys, so I went ahead and did my lower lash line in the other eye off camera. So as far as the lower lash line, I did the exact same thing that I did on my lids on my lower lash line. Literally the same exact steps. So now we're gonna go in to get into some eyeliner. So Jenny did have a little bit of brown liner on. I don't have a brown liner, so we're just gonna go in with a black liner. What I'm going to be doing with this, I'm going to be literally dragging this along like tight lining. So now it's time for the fun part. So this is the part where we're going to be doing the lines, the straight up and down through our eyes like she had it. So what I'm gonna be using is I'm gonna be using the Black Radiance Eye Appeal Lid Glit. So this is kind of like a Stila Magnificent Metal type of deal. So I'm just gonna take some of this on the back of my hand here. I'm going to be using a angle brush so that I can get the best precision. Let's see, I'm gonna look straight and I'm going to place it right there. My eyes now and just bring it down. I just realized something that this look is very, very Coachella. And of course, Blackpink, I believe, will be at Coachella this year. They have a crazy schedule. So good luck to them on that crazy schedule because they just came out with a new music video. They're going to do Coachella. If Coachella, I don't think Coachella has passed already, has it? I don't know, I don't really keep up with those festivals because hey, I don't ever have an opportunity to go to them. All right, and just so that the line looks a little bit more seamless, I'm gonna take a little bit of what's left on there and just kind of like pat it at the base of the halo. The lips were very, very simple. Her lips were like kind of like a very natural lip look, a little bit more on the pink side. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to do something kind of similar, kind of not similar. Her lips were slightly glossy as well, like very, very slightly. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the Slay Queen uh, Lip Sculptor from Black Radiance. And what I'm gonna do is I'm going to focus that on the inner portion of my mouth and I'm literally gonna just kind of like press that out. And then I'm gonna top it off with this guy right here. So this is the Lip Bar Minimalist Lip Gloss. So I'm gonna go over my lips with this gloss. All right guys, so this is the completed look. Do I look like Jenny from the Kill This Love video? So this was a pretty simple look. It's not quite exact, but it is similar to what she had on. I really, really enjoyed, again, the visual of this video. It was really, really nice, very, very creative. It was like very, very out there. And you can tell the quality and the budget was like up there or it made it seem like the budget was up there because the video was amazing. So if I had to rate this music video, I would definitely rate it visuals an 11 out of 10, or 100 out of 10. It was very, very, very good. As far as the song itself, again, it's not really my vibe. It was kind of like that, um, almost like a football game type of like anthem a little bit, but the parts that weren't like that I absolutely love, which was of course uh, Jisoo's part and Rose's parts. I really, really liked those parts. But yeah guys, tell me how you feel about this look. I actually really, really enjoy this look. It is very Coachella, I said, appropriate makeup look. But yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Definitely give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Also don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you aren't subscribed. But yeah guys, I will catch you guys later in my next video.